Assalamu alaikum dear students my name is Khuram Daad uh, in this video I am going to share with you very important idioms from the perspective of your exam and these idioms are limited in number and they have been repeated over past 5 to 10 years many times almost uh, they are repeated in the every next paper so all of the idioms shared in these uh, videos they are very important and you must prepare them if you want to get good marks and particularly in second year paper the issue is that uh, the marks of idioms they are just like mathematics uh, you can get 10 out of 10 marks if you write correct uh, sentence of the idiom so you should pay attention to the grammar and spellings of these sentences Okay, let us now have a look at the idioms. The first idiom is bone of contention. This means that it is a jerk. From your exam point of view, you have not written the Urdu meaning of idioms, but here I am sharing the meaning of the Urdu meaning. Its reason is that you will understand what you are making the jumla, what it means. So, the bone of contention means the jerk of contention. The sentence is, this property is bone of contention between two brothers. Second idiom is blue blood. Blue blood means ala nasab ya phir ala nasal se taluk rakna. The, the sentence is his good manners show that he has blue blood in his veins. Sentence number three is above board. इसका मतलब होता है शक को शुभा से बालातर। The sentence is his honesty with his friends is above board. Fourth idiom is die in harness. इसका मतलब होता है अमली जिंदगी के दौरान वफात पान। मतलब ये कि आप जिंदगी में जो है वो आप कभी बैठे नहीं, बल्कि काम के दौरान ही आपकी वफात हुई। तो इस पे जो सेंटेंस है, वो हमारे कायदे मिलत के हवाले से कायदे आजम कि कायदेजम डाइड इन हार्नेस के आखरी वक्त तक वो सख्त काम करते रहे। इडियम नंबर सिक्स इस ब्रिंग टू लाइट मतलब है मंजरे आम पर लाना। The murder was brought to light। इडियम नंबर सिक्स इस एड फ्यूल टू फायर मतलब है जलती पर तेल डालना। सेंटेंसेस his bitter remarks added fuel to the fire and their friendship ended. Idiom number seven is add insult to injury. Matlab hai zakhmo par namak chirkna. Sentences first they lost the match and then to add insult to injury. One of the players was suspended for cheating. Idiom number eight. After one's own heart, apni marzi ke mutabik. The sentence is, she chose the profession of medical after her own heart. Idiom number nine, a dark horse. Matlab hai iska chupa rustam. Our new boss in the office is a dark horse. Idiom number two. 10 is all and sundry. Iska matlab hai tamam tabpon ke log. All and sundry came to watch the match. Idiom number 11 is alpha and omega. Iska matlab hota hai awal o akhir. He knows the alpha and omega of this given task. Idiom number 12 is apple of discord. Matlab hai iska jagde ka bias. Kashmir is an apple of discord between India and Pakistan. Idiom number 13 is a man of letters. Matlab hai iska alim. Alama Iqbal was a man of letters. मतलब इसका पढ़ा लिखा शख्स भी हो सकता है, ज़्यादा एजुकेटेड इंडिविजुअल हो सकता है, ठीक है? तो अ मैन ऑफ़ लेटर एक ऐसा शख्स कि जिसका इल्म से ताल्लुक होता है। इडियम नंबर 14 इज़ लीव इन लर्च मतलब इसका है 
मुश्किल में साथ छोड़ना Do not leave your friends in lurch. Idiom number fifteen is a rainy day. A rainy day का मतलब मुश्किल वक्त. It is always good to save something for the rainy day. Idiom number sixteen is a red letter day. इसका मतलब है खुशी का दिन. Eid al-Fitr is a red letter day for Muslims. Idiom number 17 is at large. At large ka matlab hota hai azad. The criminal escaped from the jail and is now at large. At sixes and sevens. At sixes and sevens ka matlab hai betartib. Plates are put on the table at sixes and sevens. Idiom number nineteen is at the eleventh hour. और इसका मतलब होता है आखरी लम्हात में. Police reached to help the victim at the eleventh hour. Here we will conclude this video and we will continue the idioms in the next video. And uh, hope to see you in the next video. You will be back. And these idioms, again, I am going to remind you that they are very important because they have been repeated over past many years.